Show your defensive guy, but was this the defensive performance that you've been looking for out of this team? Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, especially off of a back to back. I know both teams play a back to back tonight, but um, holding on to 41 percent shooting on 25 from three was great, and uh, limiting him to seven offensive rebounds. So um, yeah, it was a good night for, for the defensive game. What do you think you guys have unlocked in this team these last five games? Um, just chemistry, playing together, um, getting clarity, um, knowing what to expect uh, coming into games. And um, yeah, I think that's what the biggest thing is. Kawhi, Paul had said uh, last time you guys were in Sacramento that one of the challenges for all the stars is to find a new you among each other and figure out how to thrive at that. What would you say would have been the new you that maybe you had to maybe adapt to once James got here? Um, just pretty much uh, just knowing that we have uh, another guy on the court that could make plays for us. Uh, just trying to find a way to, uh, you know, be, be yourself, but as well as, uh, you know, just knowing that it's, it's not going to be the same thing as before. But, um, yeah, I mean, that's it. And just, you know, all of us just combining into the defensive end and, you know, just wanting to get uh, things going on that end first and then letting whatever uh, the offense take care of itself since, since we got uh, so many scores. Um, and, you know, set the guys off the bench, uh, like Norm that can score the ball well. Um, James, um, I mean, Terrence, which in the starting lineup, uh, he could get going on some nights. And, um, just knowing every game isn't the same. So tonight might be your night, next night might be somebody else's. And, and Ty said one other thing of James Hanley LeBron also getting you guys easier shots. He said maybe you've taken less of a pounding, being still being able to get to your spots and score. Have you taken less of a pounding since James has gone from the defenses? Um, I mean, um, it just depends on the game. Uh, like I said, uh, it might be a night where uh, you know, he, he's getting a lot of pick and rolls, and you know, I'm waiting uh, to see if I'm gonna get an open shot or not. So, on those nights, yeah, and um, or the nights when PG got it going, um, you know, it, it is less of a, of a, of a pounding a pounding game. Um, but uh, yeah, it just depends on the night. And Kawhi, on a night like this where it's a wire to wire win, you guys are up big. Do you look for yourself and for your teammates to continue good habits offensively and defensively? Like what you guys started with to get you guys the lead, you guys continue to sustain that all the way through the fourth quarter. Is that something that you look for in yourself and for, in your teammates? Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, a lot of these, uh, like I said before, a lot of games, um, we're probably up in that first quarter by whatever, seven to 10 points. And we were losing those games early, um, earlier on. Um, and, uh, you know, tonight we were able to sustain that lead. So. It's about having carryover. Um, you know, they got great players on whoever team that we're playing, and they can get it going real easy. And 20 point leads in this um, day of age is, is probably about like a 10 or 12 point lead. I think back in the day, there's so many guys able to shoot the ball, um, long closeout. So, uh, yeah, we got to stay focused on 48 minutes. Kawhi, uh, just along those lines, uh, you know, you guys had that lead. You don't have fault for the second half. Like how did you and James specifically communicate with each other and your teammates to reinforce that? You know, the best way to close the game is to get the lead off so you guys can rest. <laughs> um, just for sure, trying to push the pace, uh, not trying to slow down. Uh, obviously, uh, um, you know, starting off on the defensive end, um, Sack has scored the ball very well, and then from there, just getting the rebound. And Getting out in transition, trying to get easy baskets. I guess to, just to follow up, like you, you know how last year went as far as you know, you guys trying to play the long game as far as the season, sitting on the second nights back back, watching minutes and everything like that. Like for you at this point, what is it like to have a different? Like does it feel different to you? Um, and how does it feel different to have a different mindset going into uh, games like this? I mean, I talked about this before. Um, you know, coming off of the ACL was definitely, uh, we were definitely monitoring my minutes and my workload uh, to make sure that I stay healthy. So, um, just being healthy has been good. Last question. 
Kawhi, when you see PG diving on the floor, what type of message does that send uh, to you and the rest of the team? Um, that he wants to win the game. Uh, you know, you get one of the star players diving on the floor early in the game. Uh, you know, going after those uh, basketballs. And, I mean, it, it's great for um, team camaraderie. And, uh, you know, if he's doing it, it feels like uh, we should all be doing it as well. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro.